right now at 11. Back in power. This is a magnificent victory for the American people. We're in Florida with a look at what's next for President-elect Donald Trump as he reclaims the White House. Meanwhile, Vice President Kamala Harris addresses the nation. While I concede this election, I do not concede the fight that fueled this campaign. As Democrats go back to the drawing board. Plus, reaction from Bay Staters on both sides. What voters in the Commonwealth are saying about a second Trump presidency. State officials investigating after ballots run out at several polling locations in Boston. Tonight, we're learning more about what may have gone wrong. Record-breaking heat in November in Boston. You know it won't stick around, so how quickly will the temperatures drop? The News at 11 starts now. It is now clear that we've achieved the most incredible political thing. Look what happened. Is this crazy? First at 11, Donald Trump is going back to the White House. After a re-election defeat in 2020, four years later, Trump is elected as the 47th U.S. president. And he did it in a landslide. Trump picked up key battleground states, including states Biden won, To beat Vice President Kamala Harris, this is how the electoral map looks at the moment. A couple of the states are still counting their ballots tonight. Thanks for joining us. I'm Priscilla Casper. And I'm Glenn Jones. After Trump's resounding victory, Americans now prepare for his second term, where he may have majorities in both houses of Congress. Republicans picked up the Senate already and at this hour are closing in on winning the House. Republicans currently have 209 seats. They need 218 for majority control. And earlier this afternoon, Vice President Kamala Harris delivered her concession speech at her alma mater, Howard University. We have team coverage in Boston. It was really wild to see 80 degrees today. Super wild, 82, (laughs) yeah. We're done with that until spring. But, you know, 70s, we could even do that in December. Hmm. You still have to blow the leaves? Good afternoon. That's the news for tonight at 11. For People Shard, I'm Glenn Jones. And I'm Priscilla Casper. (laughs) 